To some, it's loud, obnoxious music. To others, it's music they grew up with in the 80s. To us, it's fun, energetic music that has allowed us to be ourselves and bring people together. It's loud, it's fast, it's heavy, and aggressive. These are the words that would describe thrash metal. It all started when uh, I was eating lunch and uh, Jeremy didn't want his, uh, I think it was his pizza and I was like, dude, can I have some of that? And then he said, yeah, and then I ate it and then the rest was history. It started summer break. We were, uh, back then we were on uh, the internet chatting, like through webcam. And I knew Justin from middle school and we somehow ended up in a chat room with with Andrew. Um, we were online um, just talking to each other and we decided it was, Justin was a drummer, I was a bass player and Jeremy was a guitar player. And we said, hey, you know, we'd make a good, we could probably like have a jam session at my house. So we did. And from there that started the birth of Archfiend. Well, Jeremy, I mean, I've known him since I was like, God, he came out of my mom's womb. <laughs> like, um, gosh, we were just growing up together and then I asked him, you know, can I play? And then Jeremy, you know, he hooked me up and we just, let's go, you know. I remember the first time I went over, it's like, the, they were gonna, they showed me um, the song that they wrote, which was Metal Angst, and, and they showed me and I was blown away because I was like, God, dude, this is really cool. Um, Jeremy texted me in Facebook saying, oh, we're looking for a bass player, or do you know any bass players? And I'm like, oh, I, I can play bass for you guys. And he was like, oh, really? But I didn't play bass, I, I played guitar. But then later I started learning their songs. Jeremy was teaching me all the whole, song, all the songs in the EP. Not a lot of people were very uh, familiar with um, what uh, thrash metal was like. They, they wouldn't know, they weren't familiar with how, how should they react. People were kind of ignorant, didn't really know like what we were. You're cool. I'm not. You're cool. I'm not. The vibe at Vic's house set the vibe for like the rest of our shows after that date. Uh, it was very different from what we had before. It was like the first time there was a mosh pit at a show. Well, uh, you know, being pushed around like that, you know, you started thinking, wow, this is something different, you know, this is something real. <laughs> It, it opened our eyes and exposed us to local bands and an actual music scene that was that was live, that was like living and there was people attending shows to watch these guys. So overall, big show was just the game changer. The next big show for us was PSO's record release, which helped bring us into the music scene and gave us more exposure. There once was the kids, they were the best of friends, but rockets, skateboarding, stay up to the end. As they got older, they went separate ways. So buddy, everybody, nobody was the name. You see the big picture, have you worked over the jam? Moral of the story is to not be like them. We were mostly playing with punk bands, but eventually we got to play the show at the epicenter where we were introduced to more thrash metal bands. Go! definitely play a big role in bringing us all together. It's, it's the only time that, you know, 
you're stuck in school all day, it's all boring, you see the same people, and then you go to, you know, you go to these kind of shows, and, well, it's like, you're together, you're, you know each other, you know, you, you're all there for one purpose. It allows the, the kids to, like, meet up at a place and, um, like, listen to their favorite bands and stuff and have a fun time. It's pretty cool. When we get to go play shows or attend concerts, it serves as a place of escape or relief for us where we can just be ourselves and have fun. Archfiend is a lot more than you give a card to me. It's, a, it's an experience. You know, us as a band, we've gone through a lot. You know, it's like my second family, you know, I just get to hang out with my friends and play like music I like to enjoy. 